Hello everyone and welcome back to Airships Conquerors, guys. Franz here as always, and sorry it's been a few days, guys. There's been some lots of things going on, and YouTube is also taking a little while to process videos, so it's been a bit of a pain. So sorry for the delay on this one today. Anyway, last episode we managed to kind of conquer this area over here. We were infiltrating that. We also unlocked some more goodies, and we're currently researching the Imperial Cannon. Let's have a wee look down here. We do have land ships because we do actually have the land ships with the tracks now. So I believe we can design land ship with some tracks. Look at this. Yes. We could have this big guy if we want to. We could even add two or or three. Or how big can you actually make one? Because I mean that that I, I probably would never be able to afford it. What about this? That's some nice wee tracks there. Okay. Uh so that's the propulsion. You've got the shapes, decorations are all the same. Resources. So, uh, you know what? Let's design one of these, actually. I'm going to put a rather, uh, actually, because these give you, how much do they give you? So, generates 350 propulsion. That gives you 1,400. Okay. Uh, if, we, if we put one of them and we connect another one. No, actually, we put one there, right? So, that gives us our big layout. This is what we're going to be working with. This ship has no coal. Well, it's not allowed coal. Uh, just, you know, I, I don't know. <laughs> Steel deck. We could actually, like, you know, put a nice wee deck in between them, kind of connect them up like that. Although I'd, I feel like that might be asking for trouble. Might be better with a, like, put that there, that there, that there, that there. And then connect this up via that. Also connect this up as well. And maybe connect them up. Actually, I don't know whether if I want to put that or just, yeah, I kind of want to just put a corridor across here and here yeah I just want a corridor there and there just to kind of connect them up there we go we could have a small keel which actually adds a solid wooden keel to reinforce the ship the grand keel like a big big banner ram let's see what else have we got here what else oh, we need to get rid of that because we do need to put uh, we could put some marine barracks in so that uh, houses eight air marines ready to board enemy ships to defend our own uh guard post guard barracks course four guards to protect the ship or building all right command and crew we need a bridge actually we put the bridge like right down in the center maybe somewhere like here could be cool yeah we'll put it there Berth, add this module to fix an issue with your design. A cramped room with three hammocks for crew. Well, we're going to actually put this here, this here, this here. And how many crew do we need? Crew, recommended crew 13. Well, we don't have everything in yet, so... Corridor or ladder, we're going to actually connect these all up like so. Actually, that's what we need to do. We're going to keep these ones actually just with that and that so that they can all connect just slightly up with that. Excellent. It's going to be a uh, supply. We need some supply. Alright, let's get that. We need uh, a coal. Because a coal is needed for these guys, I think, if I mind right. Let me just have a quick wee look here. Propulsion. Right, generate requires a unit of coal every 8 seconds. Yes. Okay, so we're going to have coal very much in abundance down there. Um, I mean, that's going to be the back. That's going to be the front. So, you have two coal storage. And we'll just place two there as well. We'll also have a fire point right in front of them. Just to defend them out and everything in case anything goes wrong. We will have a steel supply hatch. Uh, two there. And two there. There we go. It's over the amount that we can actually take. So, But this is probably going to change a bit because we don't in fact have too much in the way of weapons. We do have the Grand Ram though. That is literally a punch. Can I paint that red? Is it possible to paint that red? Can I paint that red? Can I paint that red? Damn it, I can't paint it red. Oh well. You can go then. You can leave. You can you can go. I I can't remove you apparently. There we go. Right, so we got some cannons here. We got a saw blade though. I think the saw blade is definitely a thing to have on the bottom. Here we could actually um what if we do that, right? This actually connects right through the bottom, which is cool. I like that a lot. I'm think I'm gonna go for a repair bay. So we're going to put a repair bay there, repair bay there. This is going to be basically our big, big unit. A steel cargo door. A steel cargo door, if you want some. That's actually possibly better here. So we're going to put steel cargo door there. 
And we're going to put a steel cargo door there. And take away these two. There we go. Alright. So, we have a machine shop. Which is all our repairs. So, that might not be best to be at the front. We could put that... Uh, okay. Put it there. There'll be something we can fit in there. You know, like ammo. Uh, now, we want to go up to the basic. We want a good corridor. A corridor ladder. And connect that. And we also then want to... Let's connect it there. Connect that there. Nope. Put, I mean, you could put the bridge down there, to be fair. But we're not going to do that. We're going to... Oh, God. No. No. Don't do that. That also does that. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. We can't really fit anything in there. Let's see. We have a fire point. We are going to... I don't really know. How much crew? So, 36 recommended crew. Hmm. So, machine shop. We do have the machine shop in. Coal. We've got the coal in. So, how much coal do these provide? 50 capacity. So, if that's going to be taking... 8, was it? Every... Yeah, it was a unit of coal every 25 seconds. The other one was 8... Every 40 seconds? Or a unit of coal every 8 seconds. So we might need to maybe double these up. It's going to be something that needs to be tested. But what we can then do is we can layer this. Can we actually put a... We could put a nice wee cannon just tucked down there. Nice wee cannon there. Just like that. Gives them some of the... There. And then we can just layer this with cannons. We will obviously update this as it goes along. Actually, what I might do is have it so it's like one, two, one, two, nope, one and two. It's just like going to be a wall. Small, uh, yeah, we need ammo. We need some ammo stores, so we're going to put one there, one there, one there, one there. That's a lot of ammo. 400 ammo? Um, I'll put in an extra one. So we got this here, we, could, we do need to kind of fix this out. So we got the machine shop, that's going to help us out with that. Let's, uh, do we need anything else? Grenades? Where do these fire from? They fire from there. Nope. We got enough fire points, got corridors. Um, could place that there. Actually, probably want to pop a corridor ladder in there so it can get in. It can get up to all these, it can get to that, it can get to that. They can go along here as well. Excellent. Come down there. Muskets. Do we need muskets? I don't know if we need muskets. Steel. Nope, nope, nope. Right, let's get that away. We'll take this away just now and this away. Wait, what, are the, what is that? Bombay? Can't really put that because it's not really going to be doing anything. And we have a saw blade at the front, a spike ram. How does that even work? How in the... I have no idea. I mean, that works there. That has a ram there. Could put the grand ram in the bottom. Probably won't be able to move. Right, so I think we have that pretty much done. So let's have a little look at our, this. So we've got a fire door here. Which I think... Um, actually, can we put a fire door between them? Yes. Okay. And we're going to put a fire door between this. We're going to put fire doors between this. Fire door here as well, just to kind of keep it, and also all the way up here, so that nothing can get to the coal. Right, so we get some steel decking, which we probably just want to put a nice wee bit of steel decking up there. Some stained glass but windows. What is this one? What's this one? No nope. struts as well. Decking, steel decks. Da, da. I don't really know. I don't really know what to kind of fill this in with. Resources. Do we need anything else? I mean, we've got fire extinguishers. We've got fire points, we get reinforced reinforced steel. Um Sanka that has HP ninety. How much does that have? 180. Never mind. We got plenty of ammo. Printing propulsion. Shapes and decorations. You know what? We can shape this a little bit actually, I think. Let's see, what is this? That is a dragon's head. Kraken. Just stick a kraken in the bottom if we want. Right, so we wanna actually shape this out a little bit. Give me this. There we go. I'm liking that you can shape the stuff now, which is so cool. It's such a nice little touch. Uh, brass piping vertical. So we could actually have something that kind of goes like this. Uh, there. 
there. I just make it, you know, design up a little bit. Abstract figurehead. What is this one? I have no idea. We could fill that in, but we probably don't want to really want to. That doesn't really do much. I don't know. I feel like this, you know, stuff like that is just kind of a, a nice, nice little touch. There we go. And we can also like play around with some of this. There we go. Get some piping going around, so it just like looks kind of cool. Um, what else we got here? We did shapes, decorations, command and crew. We've got, got all that. We've got all that, I think, as well. I mean, it is a pretty big beast. I don't want it being too, like, some stuff at the back. I'm just going to leave it like that. What we do want to do, though, is shape it off. So what else we got here? Medium bow? No. We got some lanterns, though. Can put some lanterns somewhere. Can you hang them from that? No. We got some slopes. You can do a lot of design work here, actually. Uh, cylindrical lantern. We got lead, red lantern. We got lights down. Doesn't really do anything, no. Unless you can place it there. I can. Ooh. A light forward. Nope. Okay. Light up. So we put lights there. Can put lights there. No, nope, we can put light there. Actually, what I might do is we pr we want to put a crow's nest there. Spikes. Just. You land on us, you get spiked. <laughs> that is quite literally what that is, it seems. Okay, that is noted. Uh, let's put that there. It's a bit of sloping work there as well. Don't really. Uh, what is it? It's a 3x3, three three, it's a 4x1. Yeah, you know what? We'll do that as well. Um, I mean, you could. No, it's not going to let you do that, is it? No. Well, I quite like this, to be fair. This is quite nice. I like this a lot. Alright. You know what? I, I'm pretty much chuffed with this. Uh, so, I just need to get the crow's nest. Crow's nest, crow's nest. Where the heck did they put the crow's nest? Is it commanding crew? Crow's nest. There we go. Pop that there. Why you gotta be like that? There we go. <laughs> okay, that is looking fantastic. We just probably won't be able to afford it anytime soon. Uh, we're also going to fill it with some steel. Make it look even better. And uh, we're going to make it red. There we go. Or we can make it that red. Do you want to make... No, that's the same thing. Going to add just a little bit of blue here. Actually, no. We need the white. We need the white first. There we go. There we go. That doesn't look right, does it? No, that really doesn't look right. Blue, 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 blue. That really doesn't look right. What have I done here? It's probably just not big enough, I don't think. Unless we make it just a nice wee small one. Something like this. Yeah, we'll make it like that. And we'll just paint in the red. Yeah, there we go. Mm, I kind of want it. I kind of want it to come down one, actually. So I'm going to paint this in. And then we're going to do the blue here. We'll put the white here, 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 here. There we go. Paint the blue in. Paint the blue. It should be one along, shouldn't it? Should be here. The red comes away. The white goes in. There we go. The blue fixes up our problems. There we go, right, and well, we'll do that. There we go, it's in the right place now, okay? <laughs> But yeah, I like that. Slightly reduced structural integrity due to large size. What other modules do we have for propulsion with the land stuff right now? I mean, we just have tracks. Could you... Can't access it. 
Let's just put like a small one on the front. Like, hello! Nope. Or a small one at the back. No, <laughs> it doesn't even fit. All right, I'm I'm happy with that to be honest. I'm just gonna save that design and inhibitor. Yeah, we can call it that. We can't build it right now, so there's no point. Let's play this so we can see what is going on. It it, take, it seems to be there's a small freeze when it's kind of like starting itself back up again, but then it seems to be fine. Now we do have this guy, which seems to be doing pretty well for us. Where are you going? You're heading for our base. We do have defenses here. We don't have defenses here. Oh dear. Where's our defenses? Build land ship. Uh. Defenses. Build building. Uh. Open. Place you there. Why do I not have any defenses at my own base? Like the capital, yeah, everybody else can have like giant things and everything, but no, that just has nothing. Okay, so high pressure suspension, machine deck guns and Gatling guns, legs. I mm, reinforced heavy wooden armor optics, turrets. So that would give us turrets in the heavy cannon. I'm gonna go for that one. I don't think so. You're still. Where the hell are you going? <laughs> what the hell are you doing? I don't think anywhere has a shipyard. Because this, you can actually see, it says it has a shipyard. That, I mean, that does a... Oh, we could repair that. Give us a little bit of something there. And we got 53, because we did reduce the amount of research we're putting in a little bit. And we do have... That's at medium as well. Alright, let's see if we can build another ship so we can actually... What the heck is that? That looks cool. Also, extremely expensive. <laughs> Right, we do need to wait on a little bit more cash. Uh, I kind of want to know what you've got. I also want to know what you have. That's... Uh, I could destroy that. Bye-bye. <laughs> it just, like, blows it up. Have a trading city. Okay, let's have a wee look. You have that. I mean, I could technically take that on. Let's have a wee look at this. You're heading back there. Let's see how we get on in this. Right, start the... We're going to make sure you're on aimed fire. The fog is a little bit uh, bad there. Right, bring yourselves forward. Let's go to battle. Actually, get right over them. I don't know... Ba -ba -do -do -do. Hello, goodbye, boom, boom, boom. Oh, damn. That was quite something else. Hello. Could you guys kindly put out the fire? Like, seriously, put out the bloody fire. I think. I may have to. No, they did get up there quite quickly. So. It might need a little bit of adjustment. No, maybe switch one of them around or something. And bye-bye goes your roof. And whatever the heck was in there. Fire now. Fire, please. Anytime today. There we go. Oh. Oh, God. It's falling apart. Send another one. There we go. Excellent. Uh, doesn't look like there's much they can fire at me with. Just pieces of it flying around and everything. Go on. Lay another one on them. That's that. If we shimmy back ever so slightly. Should... Oh. I mean, go back. What the heck did I bring up? The reserve menu. Fire! Oh, wow. I think that might be them gone. And we have taken another area, which is good, but we don't have any... We literally have one ship defending everything, which is probably a little bit of a problem. Where are you going for? Oh, you're going for that, are you? Okay, well, we'll move across there and see what we can do. A fire caused a foreign agent at destroyed... Has destroyed reading for... What? Where was that? That box. I destroyed one of them. Seriously? 
Oh well, time to fight back. Uh, time to leave. <laughs> Leaving. Leaving for the day. You have too many bloody ships. We need to get more income, though. We definitely need to get more income. We probably could dial this back, though. I think. That will give us a lot, lot more income. I mean, we're getting some income from there. We were getting some from there. That does have a shipyard, so that probably boosts us up a bit. I want to have a wee look at the whole map here. Quite a lot going on. They're not doing too much. They're kind of sticking to themselves at the moment. Uh, they've got this going on. Got a lot of ships going on in here. A little bit, of, a little bit of over here. Uh, it seems to be some empires are bandied together up there. Some event bandied together up there. Some blue over here. Okay, fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Alright. Uh, excuse you. Uh, what the heck does that say? Repair? What do you mean repair? What's it even repaired for? Oh, there's actually... Oh. There's two of them. Go, 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 go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ha! And you're still coming. This is going to be a little bit sore. Okay, right. Um, I mean, actually, if I could get over you and just bomb you to bits, that could work out. Wait, go, go, go. Get over them! Go, 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 go. Fire the bombs! Bye-bye. Well, that actually worked quite impressively. You have quite the fleet. I don't like it. Do you mind not moving? I go forward. I mean, they'll take on the fortress. Will I annihilate the rest of them? Oh, ah, oh, dang it. Fire everything. Uh, we are losing a little bit too much at the front there. Ooh, nice. Oh, bye-bye. Into the ground you go. Right, get over there. How's the fortress doing? The fortress is like, um, okay then. How are you getting on over here? Bring yourself. There's not really much left of this one. I just realized, it's like there's actual gaping holes in it. Going to need to about face, so we're gonna no uh, move and flip. It means we can actually use our cannons to fire the stuff that are in front of us. How is the fortress? Not doing too well. Aim fired us now. Please tell me that wasn't my ship. Nope, but. It's not doing too well. They look like they've lost control of their ship. Maybe. Where the hell are you going? There's nothing you just left. I bring ourselves down. We only have one bomb bay left, so that's not going to be too great, but... We can actually look into doing a little bit of damage here. Oh no, there's two of them. Ah! No crap. Not sure if we have lift. Can we have lift? Yes, we have lift. Someone put out the bloody fires. Ah, come on. Come on, Smasher. Where's the coal? Uh, do we not have any coal? No, we do have coal. Come on, crawl yourself back here. There we go, right. feel like I'm on a bit of a back foot here. Um, what the hell is this? Out of water. Oh. Oh dear. They're just gonna keep hitting now, aren't they? I mean, we do. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Come on. Come on. Ah. Oh, the almond store caught fire. Well, that's it. We're screwed. <laughs> we are screwed. We just have to hope that these guys can. Wait, what? We won? Ah, yes! We actually won! Safe for ammo storage. That would be a nice thing to have. Heavier than air flip trip. <gasps> That's planes! We need planes. We need planes, we need planes. What did Dales to unlock? Optics. Oh yeah, because we're going for the heavy cannon. 
Uh, or the gyroscopes. That gives us turrets. I want turrets. We lost a smasher there, which is a bit of a pain, but we are still alive at least. Do need to hopefully get a little bit of more ground somewhere, something like that, maybe. That's that repaired. Good, good, good. Where are you going? Oh, you're under attack. Oh, they've came across the land or the sea and are attacking everybody. Right, let's get one of these guys going. Yes, please. Okay, right. They're there. They're not gonna... What is it? Oh. That looks like a mobile phone. Just pointing that out. Where did that... Where did they join up? I mean, this seems to be spreading quite far. And still got all this down here. They're down there, so... I'm just huddled in the middle. Right, we have a ship, though. That's enough to take on... God dang it! I'm gonna move down here just now. How dare you? Send a spy. Wait, gentle takeover? My spy's active? What do we got in here? Okay, that's not too great. We'll recall the spy just now because it'll give us a little bit of cash back. We sent a uh, spy into there, so infiltrating that just now. We do need another ship, though. Few City. That has, like, Oh, hello. These are interesting. What the hell are they? That is intriguing design. You can bribe them? That's going to be a bit of a thing. Let's recall that spy. There we go. Right, okay. So how much is it for one of these guys? 1600 I never make things cheap, do I? Oh, they... Oh. Okay, then. They have been conquered down there. That's not what I was expecting. Fire calls the foreign agent to destroy the fragment of Radiant Fortress. God dang it. I can repair you. You'll be... Oh, good. Right. I'm going to send you there. I don't think so. Aha! You leave this day. It's going to send you over there. The highlighter's down. We got another ship. No, we can't. I t There's not really much I can do to, like, filter out at the moment. Because this has some pretty scary stuff at it. This is probably the easier one. Maybe. Let's infiltrate and see if we can have a wee look. That was the one I was working on. And then they've just stormed over and taken them over, apparently. Whether they like it or not. Uh, let's send a spy in that one as well. Let's have a view of the city. What have you got? That doesn't look too too bad to actually take on. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Just going over here. And start. And move very, 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 very quickly over to here. Go, 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 go. Leave me alone. Oh, they've even got a wee light. Down, down, down. Don't bash that. Yeah. Back a little bit. There we go. Right. Okay. Excellent. And get right on top. Right on top. There we go. What the hell is that? Is that flying cheap? I think that's flying cheap. Fire everything. Fire the... Damn things. They certainly go on fire quite yeah. I don't know if I should rethink this, like move that down there now, there maybe or something, because this keeps going on fire. Or put something in front of it, maybe. Not entirely 100% sure, but it does keep going. Nope. Well, that took... Wow! The first one just seemed to almost tickle the fortress, and then the other one would just... Like, blow up everything. Do you mind? Is there... Is there actually... There is actually one in there. Well, there isn't any more. Well, that went pop. And away it goes. Excellent. 
We've taken over that, we've done that, but guys, I think I will do is, I know we haven't really advanced, but we were kind of more fighting them back, it's been a bit more tug of war going on. But thank you very much for watching this episode of Airships Conquerors, guys, and I shall see you in the next one.